Well, here we are in Songgyang National Park, and we've come to see is it the largest Buddha in Korea? I don't well, know, it's 33 meter high golden Buddha. It's pretty big, if you ask me. And it weighs something like over 100 tons. Wow, yeah. it's an enormous Buddha. Speaking of and as you can see, it's a beautiful day for it, so. Uh, <laughs> yeah, truly. Well, it is Buddha's birthday, so we do need a certain level of charm. It really is ridiculously beautiful out here, like... Couldn't be a more austere sort of setting. No, I feel like I'm on a quest. A quest for enlightenment. Or maybe some ice cream. I feel like it's pretty common to say that if you've seen one temple in Korea, you've seen them all. But this is without doubt... Definitely not the case. <laughs> the best one we've ever seen. Wow. One of the reasons this mountain is really famous though, is that in the 1600s, there was this huge rock shaped like a turtle. And the Chinese came in, and cut off its head, and then built a stupa on top of it because they believed that the turtle rock was absorbing the wealth of China into Korea. So the Koreans, about a hundred years later, not wanting to stand for that nonsense, reconnected the turtle's head and knocked down the stupa. Interesting fact. <laughs> hey, does anybody actually know how old Buddha's turning on was, his birthday? Was, uh, I don't know. I may have made that up. No idea. 